my channel. Today we've got something different planned. I'm gonna show you what's in that little thing here. That's my flight case, so it's my partner in crime when I'm going flying. And um, yeah, I'm gonna show you in a second what's in there. And after that, I want to talk to you what's the plan with YouTube, so what we've got planned for the future. And yeah, so let's just get started with the suit case or flight case or pilot case, whatever you want to call it. And look what's in there. First, the most important thing I would say, iPad. That's a basic iPad, the mid-size one. I think they have a mini and a pro one, but that's the normal size of them. And we've got basically everything on there, our procedure, our manuals, our flight planning apps, our fuel apps, our um, takeoff calculation apps. So everything is on there. Normally, about 10 years ago, you would have tons of paper, but that's all on there now. So, when we get in the cockpit, we put it on the mount, and that's it. Everything is on there. Second of all, if you want to be a good first officer, you always have that clipboard with you. Because then you can write down the ages and everything like that. Clipboard, very important. Let's put that right there, the phone away, take a sip of water. Mm -hmm. Next up, got that leather thing, leather case, where I keep several things in. So, I've got my logbook. A logbook for a pilot is his own manifest. <laughs> so that's where we keep all our flight hours. And I've got that one from my flight school still, where if you look at first pages, still have my PA 28 hours in here. And yeah, so you write there, uh, write everything down, where you took off, where you landed, times, which aircraft, registration, single engine, multi engine, total time, the pilot in command name, etc. etc. So that's how that works. Pilot logbook, very important. I do have that one and a digital one, so the digital one is on my phone. And what else? Passport. I'm not gonna open it now, you can imagine how a passport looks. My pilot license, that's a basic pilot license. And we have to renew it every year, which is done by simulator check. In the, my case, it's a Boeing 737 full flight simulator, which are the moving ones. And we're gonna do there a check each year to renew our license. Plus, we would lose our license if we wouldn't do three landings in three months. Three takeoffs and landings in three months. So, yes. That's about the thing with the license. And that is my medical right here. So, um, as a commercial pilot, you need to hold a class one medical. And that is, you should always be in a good physical health for that. They measure your blood pressure, your sugar, and everything like that. So always be try to be fit, and um, yeah, that's about the medical. Is it is renewed each year as well, so you have to go to the doctor each year to do your medical checkup. That's it with that leather case. Oh, damn it. Put that one back down again. Here, what else have we got? Glasses. So I've got in my medical stated that I have to wear glasses, but my eyesight is really good still, but it's just at the border to not need to wear glasses. So I need to have some glasses with me. So I've got those ones, you know them from other videos, the basic see-through ones. I've got those ones, so those are my normal pairs when I'm flying at night, or when the sun is not out, I'm wearing those ones. And oh, oh, oh. those ones are my sunglasses, one of them. So basic sunglasses with eye side correction, do you say that? 
Mm, like yeah, with correction so. and for the sides. One pair and as always you need backup. Pilots love backup. <laughs> so another pair. Those are my glasses. But very important for you guys. GoPro. I think that one is Heroes yeah, Hero 7 Black. Really good one. I think they, they already released a the eight, eight, the eight, eight was released out. a few weeks ago. Yeah, so that one is, I guess, a bit better than that one, but it's enough. Trust me. So all the nighttime lenses I have on my channel are made with that one in night photo time lapse mode, I think it's called. But the really good time lapses with all the stars are made with that thing. That's a Sony A6400 with an Sigma lens, a 16 mm 1.4 DCDN. That's what it's called. So I'm not a camera pro. Adam is more of the camera pro. <laughs> but I'm getting the hang of it. So yeah, I'm using that thing. Brilliant photos, brilliant video, brilliant autofocus. Really good camera. So one more thing we need is that safety high visibility vest which I always have it in the pilot case what else? Is there something else? Ah, we have a charger for my phone three meters long because you never know where you're gonna end up so that's in there what else? Ah, basically when I'm um, going to work I'm packing an extra bag in the morning just a small one, where I put an extra t-shirt in, a pair of socks, a pair of underwear. And because um, you never know if we have a technical issue somewhere or you gotta be prepared. So you know you're gonna need some extra t-shirts because you don't wanna sleep in your flying wear. So that's why we take some extra clothes with, well at least I do it with me. And yeah, so that's it with my flight case. Now let's talk about YouTube. YouTube, let's talk about YouTube. First of all, thank you very much for all the support so far. And let's keep that one rolling. And yeah, so basically, I had a lot of cool things planned for this year and the beginning of next year. But due to COVID, we are really restricted in filming videos. We are restricted in filming cool activities like traveling or flying and because of that sake I started live streaming last Sunday and I got really positive responses from that. Why I'm thinking about doing that more often as an additional bonus on my channel to the each Sunday video. And yeah, so I just wanted to let you know about what's like the plan for the COVID times on my YouTube channel and thank you so much for the support on all my other channels TikTok and Instagram stay safe out there see you next time